Look at all that hay. Look at those guys out there working hard. While I sit here and drink my coffee. <laughs> They still have another truckload to get, so that'll be really good. It's a really good amount because we've got this that they're unloading now, and then that pile that they got their first run, so that's exciting. But our garden is going to be pretty big. You can see where they have the string out in the yard and have it mapped out. Lilith, it's the mail truck. But yeah, I am so excited. I'm really looking forward to this garden this year. Lilith. Look at Thomas out there working hard. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, there he goes. Yeah, these folks that we get the hay from just live down the road, so that's really nice. So they didn't have to drive a long ways for the hay. We didn't want fresh hay or, you know, a super high grade quality because it's not anything that we're feeding to animals. We're just using it for our garden. So, um, I think some of the hay was baled in 2021 so it's older which is what we want because it's starting to decompose a little bit so it was a cheap price for it i think i think it was only three dollars a bale and they're giving them some extra too just to kind of get rid of their stock so you know it's kind of a win-win for both families getting rid of some old hay making a little bit of extra cash and cheap hay for us and some free hay for us to get our garden going, so super exciting. Hello, Governor. Hello. Lovely day we're having here. Tis. I think we got like eight more. Nice. Yeah, that's awesome. 47 bucks. Yeah, that's not bad at all. And, and that'll the guy be said, he's like, "Well, now that I know you guys are doing this, he's like, uh, I'll keep your information." He said, "When I have more that are kind of mildew and good for this, he's like, I'll just save them for you and let you know we got them." That's right. awesome. And that's a win-win for both, you know? Okay. 